Hello Zebra Herd, welcome to Super Mario 3D World on the Nintendo Switch. I am so excited to finally be playing this for you guys because this is by far one of my most requested games ever to play for you guys. So I'm really excited to get into it. I've only played a little bit of it years and years ago when it originally released on the Wii U, but now it is available on the Switch. And along with it is a totally new game right over here. This is Bowser's Fury, which we'll be playing at some point after we play through the main game, Super Mario 3D World. I wanna play through the whole thing 100%. Super excited to get into it. So with that being said, let's get started with Super Mario 3D World. Okay, so this is where like the original opening is. Oh man, I'm so excited for this. It, it looks awesome. So yeah, the big thing about this one is that Mario is back with Luigi, Peach, and Toad, just like in Super Mario Brothers 2. You can play as all the characters and they all have their own abilities. And there are some new items like the uh, cat power piece saw Mario just pick up there. So there's lots of cool new things with this game. It's a huge game too. Lots of lots of levels, lots of worlds from what I remember. Uh, but there's Mario, Luigi, Peach, and Toad. We'll start with Mario today. And we'll play as the other characters in some upcoming episodes as well, so stay tuned for that. But yeah, let's get started on our adventure. This looks more like the end of an adventure. We're already celebrating. <laughs> Maybe this is the shortest Mario game ever. Oh, that's so cute. They're all just walking around enjoying the fireworks. Oh, what does Toad see? Huh, a clear pipe. That's weird. I don't think I've seen one of those before. <laughs> but of course, Mario and Luigi are plumbers. They can fix pipes, no problem. Whoa! There's a bunch of stuff in there. Quite the clog. Oh, hello. Who are you? What's wrong? She seems quite distressed. Oh, no. <laughs> Bowser's back at it again, I guess. He's captured all of her friends. Uh-oh. Oh, there he is! How does he fit in that thing? Oh, no! Give her back! Poor thing. Oh, wow, and Peach is the first one to jump in. How heroic. All right, well, everybody follow after. <laughs> Luigi had to prep himself. Going to a whole new world here, whoa! Oh, this is super cool, I like it. Whoa, look at this. It's so green. Oh, wow. He's already got a castle built here and everything. How long has he been in this world? Who knows, but oh gosh, we gotta get over there quick. So we can run around, we can jump. I'm actually playing on the uh, Pro Controller, even though it shows the Joy-Con controls. This is cool, so we can hop into our first level right over here. I don't know if the levels have names or anything. Doesn't look like it. World 1-1, Super Bell Hill. Let's go. All right, let's get into it. So this game plays a lot like Super Mario 3D Land, which we played on the Nintendo 3DS a few years ago. That was a lot of fun. But this one, of course, it's a little bit more complex because we have more characters. It's on like a full non-portable console. But it's been like forever since I've even played this game and I never really beat it. So I'm excited to get into it today and just sort of see how everything goes. Uh, oh yeah, can we, we can like climb trees. I'm trying to figure out like Mario's moveset and everything. Oh, there's a Goomba, ready? Boom. But where Mario 3D Land had the Tanuki suit, this one has the cat suit. And with this, we can travel even faster. We have this like attack move. I think, yeah, we can dive like that. We can climb up walls, I think, maybe. We might have to find a taller wall. But yeah, we become super powered with this, basically. And I think the goal with each level is also, there we go, to collect three green stars. I'll be looking all over for those. Hopefully I don't miss them. Oh, what's down here? Oh, this is a cute little crab. All right, then. Anything over this way, we got a coin. Very good, I'm sure we'll wanna to try to get as many lives as we can at first. But let's try climbing up this wall. There we go. Okay, that works like a charm, very good. So let's try up here as well. So that means it's gonna be like a whole bunch of places for us to explore. This is great. Oh, and there's our first green star right over there. So I'll grab that in just a second. Just gonna grab these coins. And where was that? Right about there it is. Cool. Hmm, interesting. So, there's another cat suit if we needed it. Maybe I could have saved that. Oh, look at that, okay. 
So I do have one item in reserve. That's good to know. It's so pretty. I don't remember if, how how much similar it looked to this in the original Wii U game, if they like remastered the graphics at all. But I think it's mostly the same. It's so useful to be able to climb up things like that. Oh no, the Goombas, the Goombas. We got him, no problem. I love the clear pipes though, that's such a cool look. Oh, hello. It's one of her friends. Let's grab this real quick, a checkpoint. Okay, so I guess we get to look around. The goal is way over there. But before we get to the goal, lots of other stuff to explore as well. Still looking for the two other green stars. I hope I haven't missed those. Oh, look at the cute little bunny, hello. Oh, it's like uh, from Mario 64. There we go, we got you. And that gave me a green star, all right then. So now we got that sort of understood. Not too bad. What's over here? Oh, there is another. Oh no. <laughs> oh, the cat thought to grab up this way. This one platform looks a little weird. Oh wow, okay, there were coins on it. it looks like, yeah, we should be able to climb up this no problem as well. There it is. Oh, and there's another little bunny. I got you. You get over here. Oh, there's a big bunny too. Whoa, that gave me a big mushroom. I forgot that this was in this game. Very cool. Let's just stomp through everything then. Are we supposed to go somewhere with this? I'm sure we are. Uh, oh my, okay, we'll grab that in a second. I'm just trying to stomp through everything for right now. Out of my way. Is there anything over here then? Oh, oh okay, there is, there is. Whoa, cool. And right under this way, I got a third green star. Not too bad. Oh, well, that's me. right over here. I wanna see really quickly, is there that, yeah, here it is. And it looks like I did have a dive move there, even without, well, that's funny. Without being in the cat suit. But with this, it's more of like a belly slide. Really, really cool. Okay, let's definitely grab some of these. We can hold onto the wall just no problem for a good while there too. All right then, so looks like we've made it to the end of the level. With flying colors, so we didn't lose any lives. We actually gained life and got all the green stars and everything. All right then. So yeah, I, I guess, is that everything in the level? I guess we'll find out. Whoa, and there we go, we got top of the flagpole, which I think just like in 3D land, that does matter, so I guess we'll find out. But there we go, core's clear. Got 57,000 points, not bad. Let's keep moving. So there we go, our first level completed. We got all three of the green stars and the golden flagpole, as you can see, like next to the level. So is that everything now? Oh no, we missed something. All right, let me hop back into the level and see if I can't find that then. Oh, I did miss this green pipe right over here. Where does this lead? Aha, there it is. So I think what these are, are little stamps. So let's definitely grab that one and we can move forward. So I guess there'll be a stamp in every level as well. So we'll have to sort of keep an eye out for that. Excuse me, little cat Goomba. Yeah, I guess I can complete the level now. That's all I was looking for. Not too bad. And there we go. So I guess we get like a little stamp collection. That's so cute. All right then. So I think that's where the game gets a little complicated. From what I remember, I think every character has their own stamp. So we will have to, I think, play through the game again. I don't quite remember. If anybody knows, feel free to let me know. But oh, look at the little box. We get the hit on the on the uh, world select area. But uh, let's go into world one, two here and see how this one goes. Looks like a cave level, Koopa Troopa Cave. Let's go for it. Like I said, we're keeping with Mario today, but we'll try other characters in upcoming episodes. Uh, but for right now, we're running around. We keep our items and everything, so that's good. We can pick up the Koopa shell. I'll toss it over there. <laughs> see, I'll be looking all over the place, not only for the three green stars, but also the stamp. Definitely have to do lots of exploring. That'll be a lot of fun. So I love that, like, you know, we can go through the pipe, but we could have also, oh boy. We could have also just climbed up the wall there. Whoa, okay, hold on, let me grab this. So we got fire flower now. I'm just gonna sort of do that so I can see what's down here. Anything? Whoa, okay. Another Koopa. Oh no, hey now. It's hard to sort of see where I'm gonna land. But that sort of worked out. And I could also just butt slam these and that sort of has the same effect, so I'll keep with that for now. And I guess that's what we're supposed to do, sort of? Oh no, there was another way over. Gotcha, all right then. Huh, where's all this sleep? We got some Goombas running around. 
Oh no! Whoa! Whoa! Look at that! Okay, so the fireballs go through the the pipe. Let's get rid of him real quick. I don't want to deal with him if I don't have to. I love how satisfying it is to break these purple ones though. They make like a nice shattering effect. Oh, let's get rid of him. Or not. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so far, no collectibles. Hopefully I haven't missed anything. I'll be constantly second guessing myself throughout this entire series, I'm sure. Oh, do these disappear eventually? I'm not quite sure. Whoa, that's a little weird. But we'll get some extra time, and I'm sure that's gonna be useful at some point. I know it wasn't too, oh boy, often that we run out of time in 3D land. Whoa, whoa, that was, that was not good. Okay, that was good, I was gonna say that. So that looks oddly symmetrical, I'm sure there's something. And there's another fire flower for us. Very good. Just trying to get rid of the Koopas for right now because they've been a little tough to deal with. What does this do? Oh, whoa, we're going somewhere. Oh boy, do we have to like, defeat all the enemies in a certain amount of time? I think so. And there we go, that wasn't too bad. And that gets us a green star. And what's going on? It looks like, you know, maybe I should switch over to the cat suit real quick. Because it looks like we have something up here. Indeed we do. Ooh. Maybe. What's up here? Oh, I guess we could have gotten a shortcut before. Gotcha. Okay, now we know. We ever have to speed through this level again. Should be able to do it without too much of an issue, right? And where does this pipe lead then? Whoa, golden pipe. This has gotta be good. Whoa, okay. Was I supposed to do that? I don't know. I'm so confused. Whoa, okay. Let's be quick with this. <laughs> now they're bouncing everywhere. Don't get hit by them now. All right, well that was fun. Got some extra coins for that. Grab all these coins on the way back as well. So we'll of course be trying to stack up as many lives as soon as possible. Whoa, got the tiny Goombas as well. They're so cute, I love them. I guess we're just good to head down this way. Oh no. Oh, I messed it up. No, I was trying to, I was just trying to hop on him. We'll keep the fire flower for now then. And we get another one, just in case we get hit like that again. Okay, so we did everything back that way. So we're still looking all over. Oh no, not what I wanted. Uh, for the last green star and the sin. I'm sure we'll find it sooner or later. Whoa. Yeah, let's go down that way. So if we hold, whenever it seems like there's like multiple directions to go, I guess we can hold a specific direction to go that way. It looks like that got blocked off, so I can't go back that way anymore. Hmm. Up oh, there we go. Whoa. So what's this way then? Whoa, there's the stamp. Okay, I got it now. If we go back over here. I should be able to do this without too much of an issue. There we go. And there we go, get a bunch of coins and the, uh, the stamp. So now we just gotta find that green shell. Oh, not the green shell, but the green star. Oh, that was cool. Perfectly timed throw. And we got it. There's a lot of stuff going on out here. Can we climb these trees? Did they get us anything? We can climb them, but oh, the only thing we got us were some, some baby Goombas. Only gave us some trouble to deal with later. There we go. Not too bad. Oh no. So remember, we still have to make it to the top of the flagpole, and we did just that for our second level. Glad that we got this one totally completed all on the first try. Very cool. All right then, so with that being done, let's move to the next level. We got almost 70,000 points. We got a little coin stamp for that one. There's like tons of stamps to collect. All right then, so what is next for us? Three more green stars to our total. Oh, nice, okay, looks like we got like some power-ups there. Oh my, he doesn't look like he wants to play around. Uh, hello, can I fight you? I guess so. Is this a boss fight then? World 1A, charge and chuck blockade. That's a little intense, oh my, it's like a little battle room. Okay, got rid of him, whoa, no, not good, not good. Come on, get out of here. One more time, one more time, got him. Was that all we had to do? I guess so, we get a green star for it. Well, that was quite simple. I'm sure more difficult one of those are gonna pop up at some point. But we got that handled nice and good. All right, our score is just gonna get, like, what is our total score right now? I'm curious. Does it show that? There we go, there's a seventh green star. See you, buddy. Get out of here. 
and it doesn't show it here at the least. By the way, let's head into the little uh, mushroom hut here. Little toad house. Ooh, welcome to the to a toad house. Pick a box, its contents will help you on your way. Well, I would think that the bigger one is better, right? But not always, you know? Great things come in smaller packages as well. Now, it looks like it was the case this time. We get ourselves all sorts of items, very nice. All right then, so that was good. Let's move over the, as long as there's not anything more here. And it doesn't look like it. I don't know if there may be like hidden little secrets here on the overworld. So it might be worth looking around every once in a while. But right now it seems to just be like an odd coin or two. Oh look and there's Captain Toad, we'll be doing that soon. We're heading into our third proper level here, World 1-3, Mount Beanpole. That's a weird name for a level, but I, I sort of see. It's a giant, giant mountain. Maybe there'll be beans on it somewhere. But let's climb up these giant trees as well. Oh, hey. Okay, so she'll give me like a better look at everything. It doesn't look like it's gonna be a very long level. Of course, it's more um, about height than it is length. Oh, and there's another one. Hey, I'm gonna get a green star out of that. It's definitely worth exploring everything. I have a feeling it might be, with all the climbing we gotta do, a better idea to keep with Cat Mario. Okay, and also we can fight enemies like the Prana Plant much easier. There's a power block as well. Hmm, a little curious to see what's in there. Another cat bell. Like I said, if I can keep with one fire flower and one cat, I feel like that'd be a better idea. What is this sound? An extra one up there we go, we got our 10th life. Up the double digits. I'm sure that's gonna keep climbing and climbing. If it's anything like other uh, recent Mario games we've played, you know, like 3D Land or New Super Mario Bros. 2, those also give you tons of lives. Oh, we got another green star challenge. Okay, we gotta get all of these coins, don't miss any. There we go. Mario turns on like a dime with uh, this ability though, it's very fast. Come on, come on, come on, we got it. No problem, there's our green star we we're able to dive into and everything, pretty cool moves. Oh, and there's the uh, the stamp, really easy one this time. Oh no, I say that and totally miss it. There it is. Okay, so all we're looking for, oh no, is the green star. The last one. That shouldn't be too bad, right? Now what is this about? Whoa. Fight the explosion. There we go. So you get a lot of control over Mario's moveset with the cat suit. Definitely like a welcome addition to Mario's abilities. Oh boy. There we go. So far, whoa, not too bad. I'm still looking for that last green star though. Maybe up here? Whoa, what is this? Uh, oh cool, it's like a totem pole. Is that Yoshi? Sort of looks like Yoshi. Whoa, wait a minute. What is, okay, I thought that was the cloud power from Mario Galaxy. Not quite. Oh my, oh no, wait, 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 hold on. Oh, look at the superstar, let's get moving. Oh, we get a speed boost and everything. Oh, this is cool. Keep running, Mario, you got it. And there we go, there's our third green star. Hopefully I was supposed to jump down. Yep, okay, we're good. But there still might be more, I'm a little curious. Ooh. Get over here. I wanna try climbing up and see what's sort of like on that pillar to the right. Yep, really quickly, just get over, climb up here, and we get ourselves a little one-up waiting for us. Very cool. Okay, that might have been a mistake. Oh no, oh no! Oh, we're fine. We stick the landing out and everything. But there goes my cat power up right at the end too. Uh, I don't trust this, so I'm gonna... There we go, get out of here. With one fire, well, he, he sort of gets knocked out. Not too bad. All right, there we go. Will you give me another one? Yes, you will, thank you very much. And I am very curious, what's on top of these really tall trees? There's a mushroom, if we needed it. And what about this one? What's funny is we actually haven't really seen, oh no, Mario in his small version in this game yet. We've been doing super well. Okay, that's all it's gonna have. Worth trying now. Where did the mushroom go? Oh, there it is. Might as well get the extra points from that, right? Okay. Oh, this one's weird. So with this one, you need the cat suit to be able to get to the top of the golden flagpole because Mario sort of climbs up it. Interesting. Well, there we have it. Course clear, not too bad. So we're storming through this quite well so far. And there's a little 
Kakumba as our stamp for this one. Seems like we still have lots more levels though. I think these worlds are gonna be really long. So I hope we grab the snack. These episodes might go on for a little. Oh, we have two levels to choose from this time. Have you tried connecting and playing with friends? Just connect online or with other Nintendo Switch systems to try multiplayer with up to four players. To begin online or local wireless play, press R or SR. Well, we're good for right now, but this is cool because they added online play to the game. So that's one four, this is one five. So we'll hop into one four to start things off. Oh, look, there's Plessy. Oh, that's so cute. Plessy's plunging falls. Oh, this will be great. I love it already. He's so cute. I love his little handkerchief and everything. Hi, do you talk? No? All right then, hop on Plessy and head for the goal. Control your speed by tilting up or down, uh, up and down on the left stick. Jump by pressing B. When playing with friends, you'll find that you can turn faster and jump higher when everyone is working together. Are you ready? Then let's get going. All right, let's get to it. <laughs> this is so cool that you play the Mario 64 music. Oh boy, so I'll be trying my best with this one. Uh, this seems like one of those things where if you make a mistake, you can't turn around. So hopefully we get everything in the first try. Here's our first green star. Not too bad. Ooh, I do see over this way. Is that a red coin ring? Hopefully this is the way I'm supposed to go. I'm not getting, I'm not missing out on anything. No, I drifted too far. Ah, oh, that sinks. Oh well. Once again, I hope that's not anything too important then. What's up here? Like I'm very curious. I don't know which way is like the right way to go. Bouncing off of you. Bounce out. No, I was supposed to bounce. Oh no, and he's gone. That's not good. Okay, it doesn't look like there was too much over there besides the one up there. This is so much fun though. I love little side levels like this in, in Mario games. Okay, we'll go this way. Take a little shortcut. Oh no. Okay, there's a star that way, but we gotta get the stamp. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Where are those other stars though? Gotta keep looking for those. But yeah, the controls are very like drifty. Just gotta be careful. Here's another one coming up. Can I actually get it though? Oh my, oh my. Yeah, we got it. Not bad at all, but we did miss one. Oh, that's unfortunate. Well, good job, Plessy. That was a lot of fun. That was really, really cool. And we'll have to do it again in a second here if I wanna get the uh, the green star. Maybe it'll give me the option to like restart from the beginning at the end of the level here. It does not. That'd be a really cool option though. Oh well, uh, we'll just try again in just a second. But there we go, there's our golden flagpole. So where could that second green star be? I don't know, I guess we'll have to look through again. But yeah, that was really fun. I hope that there are more plusy levels to come. Oh, and there's a little plusy stamp, so cute. All right then. See, so yeah, we're just gonna hop right back into that and try to find that second green star as soon as it lets me. And that leads right to the Bowser Castle. We could just go there if we wanted to, but we're gonna go get everything done because that's just what we do here. Whoa! Oh, what in the world is that thing? I'll check that out soon too. But for right now, back into 1-4. Oh, maybe I can go into here. Whoa, yes I can, and there it is. So that's interesting. It looks like, I guess if I were to have gotten that second green star, I wouldn't have been able to get the stamp. So I would have had to play through this level anyways. Oh, and I can knock these guys out now. Whoa. Not too bad, I don't know if that's gonna give me a one up. Doesn't look like it, but there we go. We got the level done properly now, so I'll go back to the, uh, the overworld now and we'll move on to the next one. All right then, with that level done, I wanna head back this way. There was like a little slot machine that popped up over here. Very interesting, I wonder what this will be. Maybe we can get some more items, looks like it. Hit the blocks and make the pictures line up. You can win up to 777 coins. You'll get an extra life for every 100 coins you collect. Oh no, that's not good. Okay, we got two fire flowers, that's 100 coins, we get something. Not too bad, I love little matchup games, that's fun. So there we go, we get a one up. So that'll be fun to do every once in a while whenever it pops up. And I guess we're heading back over this way. Oh, I did notice over here, what is this little cave? This has to be something, right? Whoa, okay, yeah, we get another secret item area, hello. Uh, I guess we'll try the big one this time. Looks like we guessed correctly. I still wanna keep it, yeah, one fire flower, one cat suit. I won't keep the cat suit for now. I think the variety will be the uh, the most useful thing we can do. All right then, so with that done, 
Let's head over here and do World 1-5 Switch Scramble Circus. This looks like it could be a lot of fun. Like there's this cool circus setting that this game has at some points. Like that's totally, no. look at how fancy this is. I love it. You don't really see this in any of the other Mario Kart, or Mario games, not Mario Kart games. What am I talking about? Anyways, as you can see, it looks like we have these little Switch platforms. We had these in Mario Galaxy as well. And that's sort of what's cool about this game. It's like a weird combo of like, all of the Mario 3D games, including 3D Land. It's like a sequel to 3D Land, but has elements from Mario Galaxy and Mario 64, and I, I don't know too much Mario Sunshine, but everything else, yeah. Now let's jump up here. So far, so good. And boom, so we have to hit all the switches to open up the door. Oh gosh, lots of bees. And what's going on with all this, son? Because I could do that and get through, but yeah, I'd rather get this green star first. Boom. Glad I did that, because I don't think I would have been able to come back. Definitely worth it to explore the area before going through the teleport boxes, huh? Oh, the music here is so cool, too. Like, just everything about this is a lot of fun. So I could see how this would be, I think, a little bit more difficult if we didn't have the cat suit. But maneuvering it actually just like isn't bad at all. So definitely make sure you have that before you go into this area. Oh, we got some coins. I'll grab those. Thank you, thank you. And, ooh. Let's try to get this properly this time. Last time I messed up with the plusy level because it was just a little bit too much. Oh no, there's that one and that one. Come on, quickly, quickly, quickly. And boom, we do get a fire flower for it. Once again, I appreciate it, but I'd like to keep with what I got. You know, if it's, if it's not broken, don't fix it, as I say. There we go. And there's our green star. Was that all we had to do here? I guess we were just searching around for it. I love the, the fences with the flashing lights. Like, just everything about this level is so pretty. Whoa, whoa, watch it. Okay, so far so good. I think I might just wanna wait this one out. I mean, I could long jump. It's a little bit of a risky move. There we go. Kamek's trying to beat me up there, but we stopped them. And there's everything, including the stamp, right? I think we got the stamp. Or maybe we didn't. I can't remember. Uh, <laughs> I guess we're about to find out the end of the level is right here. Oh, it's right up there. Okay, no problem. Hmm. I wonder what all these switches are for then. Oh, I guess it lowers. Oh, wait. That might not have been a good thing. Luckily, we have the cat suit, so it's fine. So there we go. What a fun level. I really like that one. Hopefully there's more like carnival one themed ones, as well as more plusy levels, like I said before. I just want more of everything, don't I? <laughs> you can't get enough of this game, it's, it's just great. But there we go, we get the bell stamp, not too bad. And as you can see, oh, we got the Captain Toad level now. Very exciting. So I guess we'll tackle that, and then we're going to take on the uh, castle. Five green stars to find in our first ever Captain Toad level. This will be a lot of fun. World one, Captain Toad. Captain Toad goes forth. So if you don't know, these levels were so popular that they made an entire game just with Captain Toad levels. And that was Captain Toad Treasure Tracker, which has already released on the Switch before the 3D World game did, which is weird. But with that being said, like I already played through that 100%. So if you want to see the Captain Toad Treasure Tracker game on the Switch, I've already done a series on it. Captain Toad, fearless hunter of green stars, is ready for adventure guide him safely through the course in his search for five green stars. Make sure to get all five in order to take them home. Move the camera with the right analog stick to see the course from another angle. And just so you know, Captain Toad can't jump. Keep that in mind. All right then, so yeah, let's start moving through this. I think we can move a little faster, but our goal is just to sort of march through everything and grab these little green stars. It shouldn't be too bad for this first level, I'd imagine. But yeah, it's just sort of like a set of fun little puzzles to solve. I think these ones will end up being a lot simpler than what we see in Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. Oh, here's another one. But it's really just about like looking around, messing with the perspective a little bit and figuring out what you can. There we go. He's only looking for two more. I gotta be careful, remember he can't jump. <laughs> he tries though, I guess his bag is too heavy. All right, ready? This one and one more, here we go. Ah. Got it, and I guess level just ends once you get all five. Good job, Captain Toad. So there we go, our first Captain Toad level. I think there's a couple of those throughout the game. 
Course clear. Very good. All right, then. So I think we're all ready to go. The final level today, maybe. I don't know if there'd be anything more after it. But right over here, you can use the right analog to control the camera in single player mode on other courses too. Give it a try. Yeah, I, I, I do all the time, like I am right now. But yeah, as you can see, we got the big castle. We need 10 green stars to get, to it, get into it. Luckily, we have more than twice that amount. Not bad. So this is World One Castle, Bowser's Highway Showdown. Let's hop in and save the little green, I, I forgot what I think they're called like Prixies or something like that. Oh, ominous. Well, Cat Mario is very determined. Oh, I don't like it, it's sort of scary. Oh, there's soccer balls. Uh, but they're also bombs, they're soccer bombs. Okay, maybe I'm hitting those too far. I guess I could have smacked those into, oh, what is this? Oh, we got green star coins. Interesting. Excuse me, there we go, our first one. So I guess maybe if I just get yeah, run into it normal, Mario will give it a little kick. I don't have to exactly pounce on it. And up here we get some extra time. Whoa, nice view. Very like vast open water. Oh, maybe I can, yeah, look at that. And there's our badge for us. Very cool, so definitely gotta make the most of that. And this will raise all the way up here. Can I climb up there in time? Oh yeah, no problem. Uh, <laughs> let's get that as much as we can. And boom, green star number two. A bunch of extra time on top of these swamps. Don't mind if I do. All right then. But as you can see through, so far throughout today's episode, this game is a ton of fun. I'm really enjoying it. I'm excited to play through the whole thing 100%. And as soon as we're done, we'll be moving over to the next one. Um, like I said, this came with Bowser's Fury. Whoa. Um, I guess I could just attack them to get them down. But if I could, it'd be a lot more fun to bowl for them. There you go. Got it. Wait, oh, now I have it. So there we go. We already got all the collectibles for this level. Very nice. I don't know if there's any like secret exits to any of the levels in this game. You have to look into that. Boom, that was good. And uh, let's keep it moving. I don't think I missed anything. Whoa. All right, let's go. What a view. What in the world? Whoa, Bowser's on wheels. What a nice ride. Wonder how much the, the down payment was on this thing. All right, well, oh, we're just gonna be knocking these back at him. Bad move, Bowser. Hope he got insurance with it. It's already looking not so good. <laughs> the tail lights are busted. You're gonna get a ticket. There we go. Wow, that got really bad really fast. All right, whoa. I wonder, has this car been in a Mario Kart game? I'm sure it has. Oh no. Ah. Oh. Okay, well that's fine, we can just kick it. There we go. Oh, we're doing some good damage to it. Gotta be careful though, he's uh, littering the road up here. This one lane highway. There we go. Not too bad, but he's still, he's still kicking. I guess he's still cruising. We're the one doing the kicking. All right, Thumb. He's taking his time with this. Whoa! Whoa, it's got Hydrox, it can jump. That's cool. Oh no. Let's try that again. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yikes. Oh, see ya. Ooh. Oh, this car is in a million pieces. See ya, Bowser. I'm sure that won't be the last time we fight him, but it was a really good first time. Only took a little bit of damage there. And a bunch of coins for it too, that was really fun. I like the idea of battling Bowser on a car. Oh, the only problem is I don't have my cat suit anymore. Will I be able to get to the top of the flagpole? I guess we'll have to wait and see. Oh, and there's the little, the green lady. I'm pretty sure they're called Prixies, but I'll have to look it up between t today's episode and the next one. Either way, we'll grab some extra coins here. No problem. All right, ready? There we go, we got it, not a problem. All right, I'm glad we could save you. Hopefully we can save all your friends too. 
Yeah, course clear. She dances with this too, which is really cute. All right, so our first world in Mario 3D World going by with flying colors. We got Bowser as a stamp. That'll give us three more green stars. What do you know? I like the car on top of the castle now. I don't think that was there before. Oh, and she has like a little magic hammer. Oh, is she gonna build her way to the next world? I guess so. And there it is, another clear pipe. So you can already sort of see it in the distance, it looks like some kind of desert world. So that'll be a lot of fun to jump into, but I'm pretty sure that's everything in this first world, which will mean everything for this first episode. Is there any way to uh, get take a look at the map here, or in world one? I just sort of teleported to it. Not really what I was looking for. Yeah, the Sprixy Kingdom, so there's Sprixies. Oh, here we go, the course list. So it looks like we got everything, looking good, so. World one through five, or one one through one five, and then the castle, and then one A, and then one uh, Captain Toad. Very cool. So hopefully we'll be able to continue the course list in the stamp collection more soon as we tackle World Two. That'll be a lot of fun. And then after that, like I said, we'll be tackling Bowser's Fury. So lots of cool Mario action coming up super duper soon. I hope you're enjoying it. But with that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Super Mario 3D World on the Nintendo Switch. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.